Aperture's main interface is entirely contained within a single window. There are no document windows or tool palettes to keep track of. Instead, the Aperture window is divided into three resizable panels. On the left is the Inspector, which includes three tabs, Projects, Metadata, and Adjustments. The Projects tab is where you select the project that you want to work on. Select a project, and all of the images in that project display in the browser. The browser is where you organize your images and rate them accordingly. When you select an image in the browser, it appears in the viewer. The viewer allows you to quickly view an image at full resolution or compare images side by side. Depending on the work you're doing, you may find it useful to selectively hide or show any of the three panels. Use the View button on the toolbar to view only the thumbnail browser, only the viewer, or both at the same time. You can also cycle through these three different views by repeatedly pressing the V key. You can also view your image full screen at any time by selecting the full screen icon on the toolbar. This gives you an unobstructed view of your image. To exit full screen mode, press the F key. If you want to free up some screen space, you can click on the inspector icon in the toolbar to toggle the inspector on and off. By default, the browser displays images in film strip view, a single row of horizontally scrolling thumbnails. In film strip view, you can resize the browser to view larger thumbnails. Clicking the list view button changes the browser to a list view, allowing you to sort images by specific criteria. The grid button shows you a thumbnail grid view. With this option selected, you can view more than one row of images or adjust the thumbnail size using the zoom slider located underneath the browser. Aperture's interface is designed for a fast, efficient workflow, allowing you to fluidly move between different windows and views.